Yeah. You get you want to come on holiday? Why would you want to go on holiday with someone you've just been stuck in the Big Brother house with for like two months? Because it's free. But I know from the recent case of Good versus Mac um, <laughs> that taking a holidays or going anywhere with anyone, for either for nose jobs or whatever, mm. is not a good idea. So not, and look not, at when, not for me, thank you. And look at when Aaron wouldn't split that money with the others when they all said they were going to split the the prize money. Oh, when he split the vote or whatever yeah fucked off back to the his lego room um now danny was learning about geography he said has every country got a king and a queen <laughs> oh, i thought of a good name for danny but it was too late oh yeah captain canoe do you like oh, it it's not bad yeah I, it's too late though i thought of it on the day of the the final too late too late man. Pleased with that um did you like the karaoke task where they all had to like danny was like waggling his ass around uh, do you remember that they were like in a bedroom and oh yeah yeah Nick was like singing like in sushi on, but Danny was like twerking on the bed and they had a song wasn't the song especially written was no but it reminds I don't know I thought, <laughs> what, what was that song wasn't it, it Taylor Swift or something oh maybe probably but it reminds <laughs> me especially of, written by no, Taylor Swift no, but <laughs> wasn't there something in that song was it Shake It Off no I can't remember but I thought it was like you remember what in, about Danny no BB <laughs> Australia remember oh, yeah. they had that song the, the BB song yeah about let the nominations fly and yeah. all that reminded me of that song <laughs> Um, and then they had this web chat thing where people just came on and abused like the housemates did you enjoy that it wasn't bad it wasn't mm. bad that guy was pretty irritating It's horrible he said to Nick how do you think people will react to you and Harry and Nick said they'll probably vomit in their laps <laughs> I quite like that's that. That's a good answer. I don't know. I like the way Nick It's a good that answer. Guy. But isn't this outside contact? <laughs> I, I know you've got very strong feelings about outside contact. <laughs> also, what do you think about the amount of live feeds you've been given this year? Enough or I've too been much? I've watching the US After Dark, so that would do me. So, um, and also, this guy, the same guy said to Nick um, about him being up Harry's bum hole. And Nick said, well, to be honest, I want to go back up there. So well, I thought that was a good answer as well. So, uh, do you know, you. But like he says that after she's gone, mm. when he was there, he spent the whole time like mm. trying to get being rid of her. nasty to her. So yeah. stu- stupid. This Joel and Christian thing on the last day was weird. The oh, way just, that just, Christian. Yeah, the way that just came out of nowhere. Because Christian had never been... I mean, Joel's always been a closet case, but how did Christian get d- drug into this? I like it when people say drug instead of Because drug. Chloe said that he looked camp, and <laughs> he got really angry about it. <laughs> but, um, and then Joel said, I don't have a problem with anyone being gay, but I could never imagine being with a bloke. He says this on the last day. What the fuck? What, he's saying playing the straight cards? It's really weird. And then Nick said to Joel, you're quite camp. And Joel seemed genuinely shocked. I know. Isn't that weird? No way. No, you're not camp at all. The slut drop. I don't see how you can be that... <laughs> camp and not know your camp. He don't know himself. He does not know himself. It's weird, isn't it? Mm, like Nick admitted he was camp. Yeah, and Nick is camp as well. Yeah. Uh, but Joel is camp with a little bit extra. Um, oh, and then Jade come in. What do you think about that? I like good TV, so for me, it was good, all good. Oh, but I thought you didn't like outside contact. Oh, yeah, you got a point, actually. <laughs> I've contradicted myself there. Mark should have come in as well, I think, as well. Apparently, they wanted him to, but he, he, did, he didn't want to. Oh, too busy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, that hug with Nick and Jade, that was like something out of the movies. I've never seen a hug as passionate as that in all my life. That was something weird there. Okay. That's a powerful connection. If I was Harry, I'd be quite concerned. Mm, well, she's got control now, so... And Jade was slagging Harry off, and Nick still, still couldn't be bothered to stick up for her. Yeah. Even to Jade. He just floats a saurus, isn't he? Do you notice Jade stuck it to Danny a bit? She was like, oh, uh, yeah, think you're going to win it. Yeah, <laughs> King Canute. <to> <laughs> nice one. Um... And then, oh yeah, they were all trying to break into Jack's money. Did you like that? No, I didn't. I thought it was... <laughs> bullying. The only fun... Yeah, it was bullying. The only funny thing about it mm. was Jack Joe getting really angry. It was funny. But the way they kept, like, having... Like, Chloe was going, you stole that 23 I know, grand. I know. And, like, especially after what she did. And, like, the Joel took particular glee in the whole thing as well. The best, the best thing about it was they were trying to bang into it with that globe. And Christian went, I was just trying to show you where Algeria is. <laughs> what, why were those... <laughs> That's actually funny from Christian. Yeah. <laughs> Should have tried that move earlier on. But 
But then Jack was sitting in the sky lounge, like trying to shake it, like see if it, the money was in there. Someone should have just like gone for it with a fire extinguisher. He did seem like a bit funny about that money. Are we being? Oh my god! Are we being funny, money? Didn't he? he was like going a bit Garrity about it. Well, <laughs> I he thought that they were going to take, take it, it off him, yeah, yeah. and you can't blame him. Yeah, no, that's true. So then they had a very moving slideshow. How cheap is that when they do a slideshow into the house? It's um, uh, well, it's it's in, it's in the under ten p bracket, isn't it? <laughs> Just get the intern to knock it up in the afternoon, don't you? Mm. Um, and then the final bit that we saw was. Joel going to Christian, oh, get get into bed with me, get into bed with me. And then Christian's like... Oh, I'll prove I'm not gay. Yeah, like, let's prove them all wrong, get into bed with me. And I was thinking, okay. And then Christian's like, oh, all right then. And then got into bed with him. I thought that was so weird. Mm. Didn't you? Yeah. Especially on the first night when Christian had to share a bed with Nick and he was being all funny about so it. he's had a journey. Ah, finally. Finally, he's gay, brilliant. If only he'd admitted it. Oh. <laughs> I like that though, that was quite a funny ending. Um, and then they had that live bots from the house. Did you like uh, that? It was all right. No, it was crap. What about all these mics on, mics off, and yeah. earpieces? I mean, we know they got earpieces all the time, anyway, haven't they? So bollocks. And they've got the uh, they've got the uh, the quack mist as well. <laughs> so before, mm. when they get evicted, they go to a commercial break. Yeah. Then they do the interview. And we, yeah. Well, we think that mm. Ted gets hold of the housemate and says, "Look, right, this is." what's going on this is what you got to say and if you do anything else we'll execute your entire family <laughs> so but now I think this spray that they're putting on ah. uh, the spray mm-hmm. does it for them oh, spray away yeah spray yeah, <laughs> spray away well, in Joel's case gay away <laughs> any, any negative thoughts you have about production mm-hmm. Endemol uh, Lucozade mm-hmm. there's all those thoughts that are suppressed with that spray that's the technology now <laughs> can I just say can I just say something can I just Ask you something. I'm not being funny, but go on. You know the time warp. Yeah, time warp, t- cash bomb. I know it all. Do you think? I'm not. I don't care about the cash bomb. I don't care about the whatever other thing. But the time warp when they done from the bunker on. Oh yeah, yeah. What do you think about that? Ret- a returning players and B the, the way they did it. It from four in four out. It lost its way. It for, that was just really weird. Do you think four in four out was m- made up at the last yeah, minute as yeah, a way yeah, yeah. of reaching? Yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. Because there's no way they cast those people thinking we're just gonna like discard them like that. No, but they definitely had Mark lined up. Oh yeah, to come in, no doubt. Um, and but then on bots like the twins and Harriet and Kieran were all like on the front row, and Aaron they were like treating them all like nice. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, that's the deal. Sweet. That's the yeah, deal. They yeah. pay them a bit more. Yeah, so. I don't know that f- everyone's like oh that ruined the series it didn't ruin the series Mark the only good thing about the series was Mark basically um, was he the only good thing well he oh, I don't know no. everyone says Helen ruined the series but no, did she no not really I don't think so I don't think so who else come in as well oh Brian Bellow mm. but he ran away like a little baby <laughs> Uh, Nikki Graham, but she flip flopped all over the place. Mm. John McCruy, true gamer, he give it fringe, to, give it to you straight. <laughs> Dark uh, hang on, what have I can't even. Oh, Dexter, he didn't do a lot, he did he? So cool. James Jordan, always <laughs> reliable, always Brad good. Pitt. Yeah, but just <laughs> don't ask him to help you out with anything on Boxing Day. And Charlie, <laughs> Charlie, your favourite. Yeah, 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 yeah. She wasn't in for long, was she? she? Was crap. And Ashley was in for too long. It oh, didn't make God. any sense. Basic. <sighs> Basic housemate. I swear on my mother's grave, all right. <laughs> yeah, it's crap. So next, when is Celebrity Big Brother starting? We don't have Isn't a it about, fucking canoe. About three weeks hence. Yeah, it's normally straight after. So thanks for giving us now, that break. Now, what? Sure. Who? What great people can appear on this show? We've had such a great civilian season. How are we going to top it? What celebrities um, would you like to see? Going this year's CBB. Morrissey. Right. Courtney Love. Yeah. Um, Michael Stipe. Rolf Harris. David Bowie. <laughs> um, uh, ja- Emma Willis's agent. No, really, come on. Mitch Winehouse. <laughs> yeah, that, that, would, <laughs> be would, be that would be good. That would be good. Paul Burrell, I'd like to see. Right. Paul Ross. Uh, <laughs> oh, Paul Denan. All the Pauls. <laughs> Paul, the, the Paul, yeah. Oh, get Paul from BB Cam uh, 2 in. Oh. Paul, Paul Alliance. 
<laughs> Paul Wilder. <laughs> Jean Paul. Oh, oh God. Right. Okay. Careful. So, but Alan on. Paul. These are your rumored people that you. Yeah. Where's it? What, is this from a reliable source? Or? No, it's just the first thing I found. It's just tittles out. Yeah. J- who? What is the Janice Dickinson? Hasn't she, she been in already? No, she was in the jungle. Oh. She would be good though. She's quite entertaining. Isn't she like a blast merchant? Yeah. Now you've written something stupid. What? S- Stevie Ritchie and <laughs> Chloe Jasmine. Yeah. Who is she? They're like X Factor people, and they're pretend- I know him. They're pretending to have a relationship. She's like a posh. She's like, oh, oh, that yeah. one. Yeah, and they. It's a magazine deal, basically, instead of a relationship. But have they got magazine deal yet? Or they will have after this. I wonder if there'll be one housemate or two. Now you've written Gemma Collins. Now oh. come on, that's another just... jungle. The people who go in the jungle should be banned from going to Big she Brother. She walks do, after like four days. Do one or the other. You do jungle or you do Big Brother. You don't cross pollinate. What about Strictly? Mm, yeah, that don't matter because no one watches that. Right, okay. Then you put Dapper Laughs. Oh, yeah. He's well, a- he came second to Jim that year, didn't he? So, <laughs> now, who is he? What, what he's is like that? some sexist comedian. His show got cancelled because he's on about raping women and stuff. Oh, right. So he'd fit so, right, uh, he'd fit right in. Win, win, put, the money, yeah. put the money on him, Winner yeah? pick. <laughs> you got Talisa. Oh, too good. That's been rumoured for ages, hasn't it? Yeah. Now, why have you written Bobby Davro? They've had said. Les Dennis. Come Les on. Dennis, Cheggers. What about Freddie Starr? Wasn't he lined up at one point? Is he a pedo or something? No, I think they had to drop the charges. No, right. And he's now suing the um, uh, newspaper, which is always very foolish. Right. Um, and who... Oh, Natasha Hamilton. From, is that the one that looks like a frog? <laughs> is it? Because there's, there's, no. some, there's some in the Atomic Kitten that look alright. It's the one that's going out with that guy from Five. She's got red hair. Oh, she's not much better, really, but is she? she's not too bad. She's alright. At least it's she, not the frog. Should we... <laughs> oh, I feel sorry for that frog one. Anyway, it's better than Kerry. So that's Kerry the definite Kerry. confirmed <laughs> lineup for Celebrity Big Brother, which is coming on a date which we know. Uh, which we, we don't, don't know. know, sorry. Okay, so... What, right, now, what do we know? That's the question. Here's another question for you. Yes or no? No, it's not a yes or no uh, uh, option, unfortunately. Right. In the last year, mm. so 12 months, time warp ago, mm-hmm. uh, what is the best Big Brother you have seen? What, international? A- any. In the last year? In the last year. Oh, last celebrity one with Perez. Yeah? And any... What would be after that? Um, is there a clip? Is there something I'm meant to be saying? No. Oh, well, last year's BBUS. Oh, okay. All yeah. right, yeah. Well, what okay. are you saying? I think, do you know what? BB Canada this year has been my best <laughs> no. one. Honestly. That is nonsense. That and that CB, CBB. Because BB UK has been... I don't like to say, but it has been quite crap this year. Do you know what? On my time hop, where you see all your tweets from previous years, every Just year saying, I'm saying, saying the same thing. Well, the producers have ruined it. Outside contact. I hate this person. I hate that person. You've not Never been asking for live feed, have you? <laughs> exactly. It's just the same old SOS. And it's like, there's no point. You might face it. Whatever they churn out, we're going to watch it. And that's that. Exactly. All right. <laughs> anyway, at least now we can concentrate on our one true love. Big Brother 17. Yeah. <laughs> we will be doing a Big Brother 17 podcast. Once we've watched 11 episodes of it. <laughs> we've just got a bit of catching up to do. But we have to concentrate on BB UK because no other fucker is, let's be honest. Yeah. Um, but as we say here at Big Brother Bile, never ever give up. Yes. And also, thank you so much for listening, especially if you listen to this one because once it's all over, like, it really gives a shit. But, you know, we might get a few pity listens, mightn't we? Pity listens? <laughs> yeah. That'll do. I'll take what I can get. <laughs> Listen to Sister Speak. They're really good. Yeah. Um, and, yeah, they're cool. And um, If li- you enjoyed the show, <laughs> then give us a good rating on iTunes. Yeah. If you didn't, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Thanks to everyone who's been tweeting us and being nice to us. We love you all. And watch BBUS and we'll do a podcast about that. We promise. Okay. See you soon. Ta-ra. Good night.